thieves stole the wheels right off several vehicles in Milwaukee this week. Drivers found their cars sitting on slabs of concrete and bricks. Aaron Mabin has what the car repairmen say can slow criminals like that down. I really enjoyed it. I was really excited. When Christina Kennedy bought a brand new car, she had to capture the moment. I'm like, oh my God, I finally got a car. But someone has turned her celebration into sadness. Two weeks with a new car and it's just sitting here on bricks. On bricks with four wheels missing right on Oakland near North Avenue. She uses this car to take her daughter to school and go to nursing classes. Well, I'm a single mom. And it hurts like hell to come outside and my wheels are gone. And I worked really, really hard, you know. Police say the thefts happened Monday night. City crime data shows thefts are down in Milwaukee compared to this time last year. But this map shows thefts that are happening are heavily in the downtown and lower east side areas. You finally find something that's stable, something that's reliable, and it's taken from you. At 76 in Brown Deer Road, there is a similar investigation right outside of an auto shop. Milwaukee police say thieves took tires and recently ripped rims right off of seven vehicles. From the Range Rover to the BMW, thieves left behind a pile of lug nuts, once connected to the now stolen tires. And workers at the nearby auto store say thieves even brought their own bricks to get the job done. It is becoming more and more common. At Good Hope Service, owner Jesse Moffitt says there is a way for drivers to better protect their vehicles. The easiest answer is to buy wheel locks. Um, it replaces one of the lug nuts on each wheel. Basically, you get a key that you need specially to take that particular lug nut off. To hopefully stop criminals from doing this. It really just breaks my heart. Just thinking, like, maybe they'll come back and put them back on. In Milwaukee, Aaron Mabin, Fox 6 News. That would be a nice gesture, wouldn't it? So you can buy the locks for your tires at local auto parts stores. As for the tire theft crimes, well, police have not said if they're all connected.